So 30 minutes into our walk, not run. And we are coming up to a pretty awesome looking swing bridge. And I'll pan around. Here we are looking up towards French Joseph Place here. Oh, she's still going. Now it's uphill. So we're 45 minutes into our walk now. The gradient has changed somewhat. Overhead may have been a better option. Helicopter to the glacier. So this is the one hour shelter. Funnily enough, it took us an hour. So 10 seconds past the shelter, you come to the cliff bridge or clip on. My eyes closed, I'm not looking at anything. I'm no geologist, but I'm picking at all these scraped out lines in this rock caused by the glacier when it used to be down here. So, this is Rope Creek. Hasn't rained for days. It's going to rain tonight and tomorrow and maybe the next day. So we've been climbing, climbing, slash scrambling for an hour and a half now, well and truly away from the river in the glacier township of France. We're an hour and three quarters into our walk and I'll have to admit I was starting to think two and a half hour walk up that terrain could be a bit interesting. But now look, thank goodness we're not too late. That is Franz Joseph Glacier. And that is the valley. And can you see way, way in the distance? I think that might be Lake Maparika, where we swam yesterday. Half hours ago, we left our bikes at the sign over here, and on the recommendation of the stuff travel reporter Brooke Saban, we walked up to Robert Point Lookout, looking out over the Franz Joseph Glacier. It's a great walk, bit of everything, and the good news is our way out of here is still here. 